Hello Blast Processors, another impromptu video courtesy of what came in the post. Now then, Granville by Brian Talbot. Oh, have you been reading it? Very good series of books. I've got them all here, but have you? Because there's actually an extra book, kind of. Right then, let's use the kitchen work surface. It's a handy table. We have got in order of release Granville, the red volume. Then you get the second volume, which is the burgundy type one. There you go. Then. There's no numbers on these things, so this is helps. Number three in the series, which strange enough, thinking Europe is actually coloured purple, but there we go. Volume four, the grey one. Let's get lined up the rest. There we go. And then the final volume. Last one. Quite a heavy lump. This one. In black. And that's where you thought your sort of grandulness ends. But no, thanks to Crooked Dice and their 7TV gaming system, we have the source book, or they call it Program Guide, um, for look, their Lider Miniatures, officially licensed Lider Miniatures. And here it is, all nicely shrink wrapped, but we'll uh, venture forth inside the shrink wrap in a moment. So there's the front, and then there's the back. Right, now that'll be a slight jump cut, because obviously I need two hands to get inside the polythene shrink wrap. Hold on a moment. Right then, that was far more challenging than I expected. We did get it in the end. Various implements had to be used. Right, so here's the book. Um, it's a hardback. Uh, it's in landscape. We have black interior pages. Program guide. Right, and let's look at the contents. We've got credits. In there we have a list of contents. The Badger is back. The world of Granville, the timeline, rules, actual cast. What have we got then? Units, vehicles, episodes, profile cards, injury cards, countdown cards, gadget cards, end credits. So after that, you get texty bits. Obviously, all the artwork is as already seen by Brian Talbot. World of Granville. Bits from the books added in. So it's nicely in colour. Looking at the actual world, the science. Look at the world itself. I'm being quick here because you don't want to know some of the things it said unless you've read the books. So I'm just showing the fact that stuff exists in here and you see there are references to the books you've already seen yes the gravel cast oh the stars oh and other characters yes look at the backgrounds and details of how to play them as characters do, 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 do. i apologize for doing this really quickly but i'm conscious of the fact that you want to see what's inside without me sort of spoiling it all too much. So there we go. I'm going to go through quicker now. Whoa. Also makes the video shorter. It's easy to upload. And extras. Sometimes the units. Vehicles. In a steampunk world, that'd be interesting. Episodes. The rescue. We. That's how this cocoa showing you what's in here. In fact, that's a lot. There's a lot to be honest, as you can see. Um, I'm not going to start moving them in bigger lumps. A very familiar looking duck. In fact, what I want to do here is just to give you a quick in reverse order look at some of the pages. As you see, we have stats and cards for different characters and things that take place. There's our hero again. And now I'll zip to the back. Where? Yeah, interior black pages. If I go forward a bit, 
a just sneak peek earlier on. And here we see a bit about the actual miniatures game itself. Now here are some miniatures painted, because obviously when you get them they're not painted. But it shows a level of detail, so you may just want them anyway for yourself. So, even if you don't play the game, this is a very handy source book. All about the world of Granville. So, I hope you enjoyed that. It came in the post, and it's fairly new. I think it only came out this week. Could be slightly wrong than that, but there's the information on the back of the said book. So you can read it to your leisure. And down there. It's available from Crooked Dice. I'm sure we'll put the link in the description. Well, probably will do because I have to write the description. So there you go. So I kind of hope you enjoyed that. And um, if you're a Granville fan, you realise you're going to need another book. And with that, bye.